Hello everybody. So um, today we're gonna do a presentation on zero to nine cut in thirty seconds flat. Or oh, your man for three years. So basically, we're gonna use your man to speed up the initial work when you do three years stuff. And the fancy title is zero to nine cut thirty seconds flat. The nine cut that we try to reach is just there. So first the tools, we're going to use 3GS obviously, so there's a JavaScript 3D library available on GitHub, MIT, pretty well known, effort led by uh, Mr. Dube and got a very large community. What is your man? So effort from Google, that's a modern workflow for web app, basically they try to ease up various things that you are trying to do usually when you do web app. It's mainly composed of three tools, Bower, Grant, and Yo. Why are we using Yeoman? First, we are using Yeoman, but this is totally optional. No matter what we're going to do today, you can do it without Yeoman. Just, it's much faster with it. So, we're going to try to use it, because it's faster. But you cannot use it. You can not use it, yes. You can. You are not forced to use it if you don't want to. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, let's go a bit deeper on Yeoman. First, when we got Grunt. Grunt is for automating tasks. It's all done in JavaScript. You can easily think about it like a make file on steroid. We are not going to use it for now. Bower packaging. But also is for packaging, that's an effort made by Twitter. It's, if you want to understand what it is, just think of NPM. You got NPM for Node.js, for web app, you got Bower. That's the principle of it. So you got package management, you can publish your package, search your package, install your package, all the usual stuff. Our usage will be to package a StreamX extension, so to install, publish, search, blah, blah. You got you for scaffolding inside Yeoman as well. So what is scaffolding is basically you generate your initial application and it is much faster to start with. And usually you got good practice. We're going to use that exactly in this direction. We're going to use that for the 3 gs boiler plates to start fast your 3GS project and to start it with the good practice that you like. We're gonna see how you can fine tune the boilerplate to fit exactly your need. Just have to answer a few questions that people, that you will ask you. So, you gotta first to install your man with this command and after that you install the 3GS boilerplate generator with this command and then you got all the tools. Let's start the action now. Okay, first, the directory. We're going to create, uh, let's not forget that, a wonderful Nyan cat. So, you go in the layer, you create a directory, your 3GS project, MTID or your 3GS project, very simple. Then you go inside it, you go to wonderful directory, MT directory. You are inside the directory. Inside the directory, you will generate the 3GS boilerplate. You see, they give you wonderful ask you art, ask you some question. So we do it. Your 3GS boilerplate. You see, that's like a uh, hello, guys. So you got wonderful ask you art. For now, you're going to use uh, your, the default one, but you can choose among six or seven options. They so ask you and uh, generate the stuff for you. Now, we have generated the boilerplate with your map. We look inside, and we got various files. You got the file here, some make files, some vendor, obviously. 3GS is in there. So, what have we installed? First, let's start make server. Once we got make server, we got with wonderful boilerplate. So, boilerplate is a cube turning around. Very simple stuff, but this is a cube in WebGL, like nothing, right? So, we got the boilerplate running. That's cool, but that's rather empty. Let's go a bit further and add some Nyan Cat. I mean, you have to add Nyan Cat everywhere, right? So, 
what is uh, lion cat? We're gonna get that from the uh, 3x, 3x uh, extension for the basic lion cat. It's come from an anonymous demo of lion cat I just repackaged it. It is available on Angry GitHub. So this is a GitHub. You got some demo as well. You got the demo. You got a wonderful sound. Excellent. <laughs> okay, next. Okay, we got a uh, 3x Nyan Cat. Wait, what is 3x? Let's talk about that. 3x is basically a vanilla GS type of extension system for 3GS. That's something like no dependency, no framework is just a convention that we can follow in order to not to store, or to step on each other's store. 3x is uh, currently on GitHub. You got 28 models, my bad. You got 28 models on Contain. And you got, uh, for example, here, you got, I don't know, Pool Ball, Spaceship, Suzanne, some Lens Flare, Volumetric Spotlight. Blah, 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 many, many. Oh, realistic physics behind, uh, behind other stuff. Okay, so we beat on 3x, that's what we got. We're gonna attack our 3x9 cat. Probably we can find it in there. Anybody see the 9 cat? It is in there, I'm sure. Here, 3x9 cat, made of the 9 cat and Animus WebGL demo. So 3x support Neoman. Uh, my 3x model has uh, been in, exported to Bower, and that's what we're gonna use. Once again, you can use Yeoman with 3x, or you, but you don't have to. It's full optional, up to you to do whatever you wish. Let's go back and Iron Cat. First, we're gonna install 3x Iron Cat. A simple command. We go here. We type the wonderful command, it's installing, no, it's installed. If you look at, as you can see here, all the fire are knowing Bower component 3x9 and cat. So you go inside this directory, you got everything. You got your wonderful install, and here are the files for the 9 and cat. To add the 9 and cat inside your scene, you need to install, include a script and some JavaScript on your DAM. Let's do that. We go here, we go here. This is the file that we have. This is our index.html, so the page that you are running. First stage, let's install the script itself. You go here, you got the script. You save the script. We just added the script itself. So now we add the JavaScript in order to add the Nyan cat to our scene. We put that uh, on here, we put some comment, Lion Cat, excellent! Uh, so we got the Lion Cat in sorry guys. Let's save the file. We go here. Yeah, well, most. Ah, yeah, yeah, we got part of it here. You see, there's a Lion Cat, but uh, there's a cube as well, right? So we see only the tail. One last step. Let's remove the cube. So we are here. This is the source. We look for the cube. You see the cube here. You do that. You do that. You kill the guy here. And now you will test. Ah, you got your wonderful Diane Cat. Isn't that great? And you got the exact same thing here. So that's enough for now. Let's pack it up. To generate the 3GS boilerplate with your man, just type your 3GS boilerplate. Not that hard. To install a 3X extension for 3GS, Bower install 3X9 and CAD. Simple enough, guys, seriously. Some useful links, so the home page, the 3GS, and the home page for 3X. So, my name is Joe Machen, and I hope you have fun. This is all for today, guys. Have fun.